What's up guys, we're gonna be trying classic kids snacks to see if they hold up to the memories. You're watching school lunch. Alrighty, let's see what we got. Ooh, okay. Ooh, Ooh it's a good day. Yeah, ain't nobody got nothing today. Grab your own ride today. Hey, it's gonna be a good day. You know, honestly, growing up as a kid, I never had these. I never had these. My family, you know, we were kind of poor, so and like the uh, ramen noodles were a lot easier. Plus, you get like what, fifty for like five dollars. I thought this is what you had when you were poor. <laughs> oh wow! So I guess I'm a lot poorer than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you were. <laughs> Before Olive Garden, this is what you was on. This, this is your key to Italy, right? Here. Right. This was this was what I knew about Italian food right here. This is what I didn't like about this is that it does this. Girl, hey, what you hey, doing? I'm just saying, like, how, how safe is this? Oh, it smells like fifth grade. Oh, you don't know about this one. Your mama love you when she put that can in here. Hey, dog. For real, oh, your mama really cared about your, like, she didn't want you to get sick. This tastes like I can't. absence of care. I know, it that's... tastes like nothing. I was good. I have no feeling about it at all. Mm, yep. I was never a fan of these. It probably tastes better if it has some hot sauce. Let me try it. Hot sauce on this? <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> he ain't lost his touch. He ain't never did. He ain't lost his touch. Hey, the chef. 11 herbs and spices. Woo. This smells like hot throw up. Oh, why was it man? I'm straight. I think Chef Boyardee is the Brian McKnight of canned goods. Just because they give you classics every time. They don't ever fall off. Right. It's just when he come out, he gives and you a I classic. Start back at wow. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Wow. See, I usually like ravioli. And I would like this ravioli if I didn't know what real ravioli tasted like. <laughs> so I have to say this is I'm not really a fan of this at all. Yep. You this some fine soup to pour ravioli on you. Three, we in my P class, but I'm not running today. But this is something that happens like it's in your earthquake kit. Like you can't eat this as an adult this for is real. A, yeah, MRE, like, yeah. Yeah, this, this is, is like a... life is like zombie apocalypse and I need- Did you eat this when you was a kid, white man? Oh, yeah. There you go. White man improved. No, I ain't running these laps five. I'm just gonna keep eating these snacks cause I see potential in Chef. Man. I ain't never cried off Chef Boy RD before. Me neither did. To watch y'all down, we have High C Orange Lava Burst. Lava Burst. You know, I know a crip named High C. He's a fine fellow. Hey, did you hear that McDonald's is, is taking these off the shop? Off the, off the McDonald's? I heard about that. So I gotta, Steal these from the kids now? Just right. to get that high C feeling again? It ain't, it ain't hard. Okay, it's all coming back. It's all coming back. <laughs> mm. I remember I used, to, I used to get whooped a lot as a kid by my grandmother and uh, to calm me down to where she would just give me high C and you know, it it didn't make whooping seem that bad. Mm -hmm. Wow. This is a blend bad. of oranges, pears and apple juices. This is good, this is smoothie. Yeah, but, it but it says only 10%. 10% juice. 10% juice. Yo, they're so small. Like, it, you, when you were a kid, they were like big. You'd be like, oh, I can't really drink a whole high C. And now it's like, it's gone already. I, I slept two times and it's gone. I'm kind of disappointed in the size, if I'm being honest. Oh. This is really ruining my day. <laughs> Damn, dude. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite. Fruit roll-ups. Woo! I love fruit roll-up because this is like a snack for like selfish kids. Like it is. Yeah. I, I used to lick all on it and cough all on it so nobody else can get it. And you should go right. like, and uh, he'd be like, oh, I already licked on it. Sorry. Uh, I can't have. Uh, and then there would be that one fine. kid like like Ron that'd be like, that's okay. These are special fruit roll-ups. These are the ones that leave. I think it has the. You can put the um, tattoo on your tongue with these. You press down hard enough. Either you can open these perfectly, right. or you can open them and it's like horrible. Like you taste in plastic and fruit yeah. roll-ups. As a kid, I didn't really like these. These were very time consuming. You see this, it's already 30 seconds into it. I still haven't opened it yet. See, look, and if it was hot, oh, it was horrible. Look, oh, it worked. <laughs> I grew up in Arizona, <laughs> it was different. <laughs> it was different, if these was melted, it was like, oh, I'm having plastic in this. Bro, you oh got my a basketball type too. That's crazy. This is teaching girls how to be hoes early on. I like, told you. Hey, hey, like it's NBA season. 
now. That's why I be like, ow. Hey. Whoa, you eating plastic and some more? Do you not know how to eat this? It ain't coming off when I use my hands. So you just gonna eat the plastic? I think the candy tastes good. Uh, I wouldn't buy my daughter this, you know. I don't want them looking like these girls with tattoos on their tongues. Anybody kissing my baby in the mouth? Oh, you remember? Hey, this is one thing people used to do all the time. They used to put it around their thumb and just suck their thumb. Yeah, all, all, the, all the good looking girls did that in did elementary. They? All the fine girls did that. They were like all some young hood rats and they knew it. They'd be like, oh, all let me there. You're gonna just help me with my thumb. homework. Like, yes, I'm gonna help you with your homework, girl. I'm trying to be that fruit roll up on your finger. Where did they learn that at? They mama. Now we are on to Pop Rock. Pop Rocks is dangerous. Do they you guys are. not understand? Like, if you drink soda and then take some of this, like, you're gonna explode. That's a lie, girl. I tried it. Aren't these illegal? When your girl acting up, eat her out with these. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <That's> Exploded. <laughs> <laughs> this is a felony. I think it's illegal to put it in soda. I think that was a thing back in the day. Like, if the cops caught a kid with Pop Rocks and soda together, you was getting, like, minimum, like, six months in the county. I'm excited about this. That's what it was all about, that little crackle. That's when we have kids ate these. They're not good. They were never good to me. It's that little crackle. Let me hear yours. Open your mouth. Mm -hmm. uh. I hear it in my head, damn. <laughs> How scary were you would drink these with, like, soda? Remember it was an urban legend? Yeah, it was like, drink these with soda. And you'll die. Somebody said you'll die? Did you try that? <laughs> no, I didn't try to commit suicide. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Uh, you hear it popping? Thanks for watching School Lunch. If there's any other retro snacks you remember, be sure to throw them in the comments below. And please like, share, comment, and subscribe to All Def Digital. Oh, this is too sweet. Oh, whew. Get you right here. You grown.